welcome, boys and girls, once again to Cooking with Rhythms. Your special host today is Da Vega. <laughs> anyway, boys and girls, just like we did last time we were together when we talked about superheroes, now we're going to talk about rhythms of your families. For this activity, you will once again need your bag of flour or container of flour. You will need your salt dough that we have created together, or play dough is a perfectly fine substitute if you have some. A towel to clean up your mess, a nice fine table to work on, and of course, lines of flour to divide your groups of beets into measures. Remember, we need one, two, three, four measures. I'll give you about 30 seconds to take your flour out of your tub and sprinkle it onto your table, just like we did last time when we were together to make your measures. Do that now. I'll wait. Yes, this is Baby Yoda, I'm sure. <laughs> Just remember, boys and girls, Mando is not the coolest Star Wars character in a mess. <laughs> impressive. Most impressive. Your measures look as, just as good as mine, young students. Okay. Just like we did last time, remember, one ball of dough per box equals one sound or one hit on your bucket drums. So when we play these, if there's one ball of dough in a measure, it gets one hit on the top of your bucket drums. Two balls means two sounds per measure, two hits. If we put an X, it means silence. So let's do that now. Let's build a rhythm with just one ball. Each. One sound per measure. One beat. Very good, boys and girls. Now, can you think of family members or names we give to members of our family from like one syllable? Take a point. Here's a rhythm. I'm going to try this one. Mom, dad, mom, dad. Ready? Try that. Try to build it and play it. Mom, dad, mom, dad. And you could even put your names in. My name is Fred. My name is Bill. My name is G. Whatever your name is, you can plug in your name to your family for that, or your personal name. But mom and dad are two common family members. However, some of us have different structures of families. I can think of mine. I have aunts and uncles and grandmas and grandpas. So how do we make grandma and grandpa rhythms to play? We divide our dough in half. Grandma. Grandpa. Auntie. Uncle. Because everybody's family looks different and unique. So however your family is, make the rhythm that is your family. Grandma, grandpa, auntie, uncle. Take a moment and build your rhythm, just like you see here. Two sounds per measure, and then we'll try playing it on our bucket drums. Very good, boys and girls. Let's try to play it. My turn first. And you can either point to it like I'm doing, or feel free to play this on your bucket drums once you build it in your dough. Grandma, grandpa, auntie, uncle. Grandma, grandpa, auntie, uncle. Ready, steady. Try and play it on your drum. Grandma, grandpa, auntie, uncle. Grandma, grandpa, auntie, uncle. Very good, boys and girls. A couple other rhythms we can do. Let's clear them off. I need to make it X again. I'm going to put a rest in. Where should I put it this time, boys and girls? Should we put it in measure one, two, three, or four? Just shout it out. Measure two had the most shouts. So everybody take some flour and put an X in measure two. Put your hand nice and flowery. No fun if you don't get messy. Very good, boys and girls. The force is strong with that X. It means when we get to measure two, we do not play. It is a silent measure. So there are no beats and no sounds on your drum. There are other members of families 
we're going to build some more two-syllable family member ribbons. I got into one. I have a lot of cousins. I don't know if you do. I have one I'm really close to. His name is Raymond. So, cousin. I have a rest. And then I have a brother. I don't know if you have brothers or sisters. We have a brother right here. And then over here, we're going to put sister. <laughs> Build that rhythm for me right now. An X in measure two. Cousin, brother, sister. And then we're going to play it together. Go ahead and build that rhythm. Take your time. You know, one time I had to tell Luke this. I am the father. And it was true. What do you know? All right. Thank you, boys and girls, for taking the time to build this rhythm. Let's say it and point to our rhythms on the table and then we'll get out our bucket drums and try to play it ready steady point and say this with me cousin shh. brother sister cousin shh. brother sister you might say mr k could it be sister brother or could i put cousin over here if you want to change the rhythm and say it a different way that is okay with me let's try playing it now get out your bucket drums i'm going to put down my fingers and bucket drum sticks one Two, let's start right here and play. Cousin, shh, brother, sister, cousin, shh, brother, sister, cousin, shh, brother, sister. Wow. Join me. Together, we can rule the galaxy. That's what I believe. You played that rhythm so well, boys and girls. I think we can rule the galaxy of rhythms together. Just remember, family is the most important thing. After all, family is what saves me in the end. And if you don't know what I'm talking about, hopefully you'll tune in to Star Wars sometime and find out yourselves. Until then, may the Force be with you, boys and girls. And enjoy the rest of your leveling up in the Darth Vader. Signing off.